Hello all of you. Welcome to tutorial on foreign key constraints in SQL. In this tutorial, we will try to know the basic concept of foreign key. Foreign key constraint. A foreign key is a key used to link two tables together. A foreign key is a field or collection of tables in one table that refers to the foreign key in another table. SQL syntax. Table column name, then data type, then foreign key, then references, then reference table name, then foreign key or reference table column name. So let's go to, go to the query window. How do we uh, give an example for foreign key constraints? in SQL. We have one table customer info here. So if I select the columns for customer info, select start from yes we have customer ID first name last name and is so I just want to add another table named as cust customer order so create table customer order dbo customer order and then i just want to add some column customer id customer order id type integer not null primary key identity and then comma one comma one comma one sorry and then i just want to add another column name uh, order num order number or o r d order b order number inverter fifty not null and then I just want to uh, reference I just want to add another uh, column for customer ID customer id here type is integer int integer so uh, integer and not null so the this customer id i just want to add a reference or foreign key table uh, for customer info so we just need to write foreign key references dbo dot customer info and then the primary key or foreign key name here customer id which is the primary key for customer info table and this customer id is referenced here in customer order table so in this way we can use foreign key reference for customer info table so if i execute this yes common successfully completed so if i refresh uh, here customer order yes we have uh, three columns here customer order id which is primary key customer number uh, sorry order number and customer id here the fk fk means foreign key so in this way we can use a foreign key or foreign key reference in our table so thank you for watching this video keep watching the next video thanks again